you're drifting away from the dear sea. Friend tells me she died here at the hospital a day after she went into cardiac arrest earlier this week. Those who love her say they're still in shock. A local cardiologist tells me it's important to always be aware of any risk. She had a contagious smile and made everybody so happy around her. To know Alicia Groblinghoff was to love her. She was um, an amazing human being, a humanitarian. Her friend and boss of 30 years, Michelle Morgan, shared everything she'll miss just days after the 46-year-old suddenly died. Suddenly, without warning, collapsed at the gym and suffered a massive cardiac arrest. Morgan says Alicia had no history of heart issues. She's one of several who have died of cardiac arrest in the last week here in Las Vegas. On that judgment day. Both in the geographical spread, but also in the in the in the ferociousness of the of the outbreaks. Avian influenza is spreading rapidly across the country in both wild and domestic birds, including right here in Montana. Now we have over 50 million birds affected, um, and it's probably the the, the most uh, consequential. Uh, you know, animal health disease outbreak in the country. Montana Department of Livestock Veterinarian Dr. Martin Zalewski says the virus has mutated to a highly pathogenic form, crossing over into different species. We know there's just a lot of virus in the environment, and there has been for many months. The virus has crossed over into mammals as three grizzly bears in Montana tested positive this fall after showing poor neurological issues, including disorientation and blindness. When the pale Stage in Nashville, Grand Ole Opry on Sunday, February 19th. Jordan's celebrity friends are set to honor his legacy with a show called Reporting for Duty, a tribute to Leslie Jordan. Your per wicked soul. For you can't pay your way. Bye.